you know, earlier on in the call when he came on, he was asking, what do I do with these clients, right? What do I do with these clients? 60 to 70 clients doing payroll, 30 to 40 clients on sales tax. You know, he came on here, he already knew what I was going to say, right? And there's a lot of you guys sitting there right now thinking the same thing, right? I know you don't want to message him. I know you don't want to message him. Don't make me do it. There's a lot of people right now, for a lot of you guys, sitting in the existing business that needs something, right? First person that comes to mind right now. Very first person, existing client needs an additional service, right? Existing client needs an additional service. Just message them. Hey, thought of you today. Thought of you today. Are you free to talk tomorrow? Every single one of you on this call, and I can see here there's, I can see how many people are on here as we get into the end of this thing. Every single one of you on this call has, a, has something inside of your business right now that you can close before the end of the day tomorrow. But well, it could be a friend, somebody in your network too. Regardless of what's going on with any marketing, any client meetings or anything, can you squeeze one meeting in tomorrow, two meeting in tomorrow, three meeting in tomorrow, and close something else before the end of the week? Can we do it? So, you know, it's funny because no matter how many times I tell you guys this, it's just like me. It's like no matter how many times my personal trainer has to show up in my damn lobby to get me to the gym, he's got to do it again because I'm not going to go, right? It's so funny. About 70% of the time that I like wake up in the morning for the gym, I tell Amanda, gosh, there's just no way I would go unless this guy forced me to go. There's just no way. And if any of you guys are um, on this call right now and have somebody, just message them. Just message them. It's sitting right there. You're going to feel better about yourself. I always feel better. About, that's the funny part, too, is after the gym, I always go back to my house, sit down, sit on the porch, look at the ocean, and I just feel so much better about myself, right? And I just feel so good, right? Same thing after you close the sale and you do anything in life that re you know, requires that push or that resistance, but you don't want to do, but you do want to do. You just don't want the pain, but you want the reward, and then you do it, and it honestly feels so much better because you had the pain too, right? 